Quantum physics has revolutionized our understanding of the universe. Everything around us, including ourselves, is perceived as vibrations and frequencies. Astrologers recognize that our sense organs interpret these vibrations. When we hear something, it's a frequency. When we see something, it's an electromagnetic radiation frequency. We no longer live in Newton's world. We now have tools that allow us to see infra, lower than, or ultra, higher than, frequencies that we previously couldn't see. Astrologers are skilled pattern seekers, searching for correlations between celestial rhythms and terrestrial events. Throughout history, astrologers have been sought by kings, queens, popes, and religious leaders to gain insight onto what lies ahead. Saturn, the farthest planet from the sun in ancient times, was associated with slow movement and symbolized father time. Its energy is often associated with cause and effect, karma, Newton's third law. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. So alignments of Saturn often carry a sense of judgment or consequences with them depending on our actions. Notably, Saturn's alignment with Pluto every 33 years has coincided with significant historical events such as invasions, revolutions, and even the establishment of empires. By studying the cycles of Saturn and other planets, astrologers gain insights into the unfolding fabric of history and its repetitive clashes. Here's five Saturn-Pluto alignments that have rocked history. Let's start with one that everyone's familiar with, 2020. So when astrologers were warning about 2020 being a big deal, that's what they meant. Number two, 1914. A large sequence of events occurred at this time, the biggest one being World War I. England sent representatives to Arab countries against the Ottoman Empire, promising them freedom after the war, and this is why countries such as Iraq, Iran, Lebanon, and Syria were created. Number three, 532 AD. Justinian, who tried to recreate Rome, put down a tax revolution. His troops went into Constantinople and killed 30,000 in one afternoon. Number four, 629 AD. Muhammad walks into Mecca and takes over the city without firing a single shot and declares the state of Islam. It was declared a city-state during this alignment. And number five, the year 1834. This is a big year. English abolished slavery in the British Commonwealth. Spain also took a bunch of L's during this time. They lost control of South America. You can't deny this stuff is very interesting and hopefully I've convinced you a little bit how these planetary events actually do correlate with things that happen on Earth. Remember, it's not causal. Not every time this alignment happens, something big is going to happen, but it is interesting to notice the correlations between the planets and events here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give me a follow and like it and I will see you guys in the next one. Love you.